We are thrilled by everything that's happening here at George Whip. It is reflective of what is happening all across RPS. As you can see, uh, we are delivering food to our families, uh, about 800 families a day from just this site at uh, George Whip. Uh, we're delivering about 13,000 meals every single day across RPS. We've already passed a quarter million meals uh, since the closure. So, so grateful to our nutrition workers, custodians, our administrators. We have Principal Pisani here who's helping out all of our volunteers. This is essential. Food is essential in this time of the pandemic. And I am just grateful for RPS, our superintendent stepping up, making sure all our children and their families get what they need during these difficult times. And this is the, this is the front of the house, right? This is the, the, the storefront. These are two of our amazing volunteers. Thank you. Um, and here we give out meals. Uh, we have books that get donated and get passed out, uh, diapers, um, as well as learning packets. Well, first I want to thank the superintendent and his team over at RPS. Uh, I must say, uh, this is the greatest demonstration during this difficult time that we are all in this together. It's not, you know, uh, us versus them. It's Team Richmond versus COVID-19. And RPS, Richmond Public Schools, has been on the forefront. It was now roughly five weeks ago that uh, Mr. Cameras was one of my, in one of my leadership meetings, and he told me about the number of sites that we were gonna have in the city of Richmond for food distribution. Um, and how many sites compared to other cities at, at the time. And I think he's expanded on, on that as this is developed and this, how this has evolved. And that just shows the commitment that RPS has to for our kids. Um, yes, we are in a new normal right now, but what's, what still matters uh, day to day is that our kids get everything they need and that their families get everything that they need. Mm -hmm.